So anyway, I got this night vision tube off eBay from the UK. Uh, it's grade B, they reckon. But it's not too bad. I mean, it's a couple of smears and, and uh, artifacts on the screen. Just a little bit, but I don't know if that's just because I haven't wiped the tube um, lens, to be honest. Could even be at the back here. I actually think it is. Let me just quickly wipe this. Oh! Fuck, it was. <laughs> it was the rear view window. you got to make sure you wipe your rear view window. That's the Southern Cross. I'm using a Pentax 15. Oh, oh, did you see that? Was that a meteorite? I think I saw a meteorite. Oh, my God. My God, the light gathering capabilities of this thing. You're already straight off the bat. I would not have seen that with the eye. No Nothing's doubt. Nothing's going to hide. Oh, what's that? What is that? Is that a meteor or is that a bird? I reckon that's a bird, eh? I don't know. So, uh, just above that planet there. Look at, where has it gone? There it is. Look how slow and small that is. I just barely see it on the LCD display. I mean, the LCD display is tiny. It doesn't give me the kind of detail that I want, but I'm 100% sure that's a sat, that one. Whoa, did you see that? That must have been a meteor or something, no? What was that? Anyways, guys, I uh, just want to give a special shout out to Alan from Skywatchers Oz YouTube channel. Click the annotation there, it'll take you to his channel. He really helped me out in the construction of my tube. I had lots of questions and he was always there to answer them. Anyways, guys, I just want to show you a couple of specs of what's actually on my tube. Looks may be deceiving. Yes, this bad boy is wrapped in several layers of duct tape, but I can tell you right now, it performs just as good as it would if it was in a proper housing. Yes, I'm going to put a proper housing on it. Okay, first up, the lens we have attached to the night vision is a SMC Pentax M with an f-stop of 1.4 and a 50mm lens. In the rear, with the gear, we have the Sony HDR CX405 Handycam. Records in 1080p at 50 frames per second or 1080i interlaced. The main unit itself is a EEV X British Military Image Intensifier Tube. Funny story, when soldering the wires to the tube and turning it on, I ended up shocking myself with a 9 volt current. Anyways guys, stay tuned for more videos, I hope you enjoyed this video. Prepare yourself for more top quality uploads. Thanks for watching.